County that has already burned one home. We are told it is threatening dozens more. ABC 4's Nicole Newman telling us about this in just a second, but here are some basic details. The fire began earlier today just south of Highway 40 near Fruitland. Now, Nicole Newman is live tonight from Duchesne County. She has more tonight on this rapidly moving fire. Nicole, what can you tell us? Well, Nick, this is the 6400 fire, and after sparking, as you mentioned, this afternoon, it's already burned 200 acres. You can see for yourself just how much damage this fire has already caused. All these dark areas, of course, where flames have already scorched, and you can see in certain areas where the wind right now, we want to make note of that. It is very windy here, so that can't be good news for firefighters, but you can see how it is blowing the smoke. Now, air support is here, so this fire is being put out by the air and on the ground. Now, where it is burning, it is near Fruitland, south of Highway 40, which was temporarily closed, but is now back open as crews gain a handle on flames. The fire was moving east. One residence and two outbuildings were destroyed, while 24 other primary structures are still potentially threatened. Right now, the cause isn't known. We do have calls into the Utah Division of Forestry to find out more information. As of right now, we are still waiting to hear back. But that's the latest here in Duchesne County. Live in Duchesne County, Nicole Newman, ABC4 News. Okay, Nicole, thank you. Highway 40 back open, 24 homes now threatened. We have